All right, hello, and welcome back to StarCraft 2 Heart of the Swarm. Uh, I was going to record Dawn of War yesterday. However, I had to keep an eye on our um, family dogs while others were away. Uh, because they ate a couch, and there was fluff everywhere, so I had to deal with that. Uh, so today, since while well, people are gone and I have some time... Uh, I'm gonna finish StarCraft, I'm gonna finish this, go all the way to the end, and then I'm going to record some Dawn of War 2. Cause I ain't got much left. Uh, roughly five. Take the Leviathan up. We're leaving. Gargi, you saw something in that lab. In Narud's mind. I saw Amon. Older than the universe, more powerful than I can understand. And now he's alive again. Then he shall fall before the swarm, like all the rest. We don't even know where he is. We must prepare for his coming, but I have a few scores to settle first. At your orders, we will move our Leviathan into Dominion space and begin searching for the Terran ship Hyperion. You wish their help in finding the Terran Jim Rayner. Aye, we do. So off we go. I actually have a statue of the Hyperion. I got a statue of a carrier too. I'm just waiting to get the Broodlord that's not yet out. <laughs> or arrived. Not entirely sure which. Either way, I'll have all Larry, three soon. Picking up some kind of reading. Warning. Psionic waveform detected. Scale. Unclassifiable. Kerrigan, what happened to you? How? There's no time. Listen carefully. Jim is alive and I can't find him. But you can. Hack the Dominion Network and figure out where they're holding him. How can we trust her, Valerian? If there's even a chance that Jim is alive, I'm going after him. Hacking the Dominion Security Network will prove difficult. Only one man can hack that network. Colonel Orlin. And he's being held prisoner by Mira Han. The mercenary leader? Isn't she a friend of yours? Not exactly. It's complicated. Let's just get this done. Find him, Matt. We both owe it to him. I have a vague idea as to which mission this is. But I really can't fully remember. Ooh! Space? We have arrived in Dominion space. Should we move on Core Hall? Not yet. I have to deal with something first. Will this give us some special advantage, my queen? Should Abathur be ready for new essence? Silence, Isha. This is a personal matter. It will end badly, but I must see it through. When I see the stars arrayed before me like this, I think of Earth. I remember its green hills. You can't go home again. I know. I have no place on Earth now. I mean, I won't let you. Your return would be noticed by the government of Earth. They might consider another expedition to our little corner of space. They will come back someday, you know. I do. And I will be ready for them. Well, I, they easily could do another game around that idea. You know, the UED coming back for a second show. It would easily be another campaign if they did. Now, that could even be involved in a first-person shooter that I really feel like they could easily do using this level of graphics and shit. Did it work? I wish they'd bloody do it. Oh, I'm one point off another level. God damn. To hack the Dominion's I don't get any from this one. We need the best decryption expert out there. Colonel Orlin. Unfortunately, he's being held captive by Mira Han, one of the meanest and craziest mercenary leaders alive. I think I know what this mission is. I think we're going to capture space stations. But that could be a Legacy of the Void mission, I really don't remember. Because I think there's a Hyperion mission in... Legacy of the Void as well, but... Mira Han, 
This is Prince Valerian. Do you read me? Of course I do, Princess. I know you're working with Matthew. Put him on, please. You forget yourself, mercenary. Hello, Mira. Matthew, you never write, you never call. It's almost like you don't care. I'm here to ask for your help. You've got Colonel Orlin and we need him. He's the only man who can hack the Dominion's deep encryption network. Well, I'd love to help. I just need the permission of James Raynor. Jim's not here right now. Oh, dear. Then I'm afraid I cannot give you Colonel Orlin. Look, Mira, we need Orlin to rescue Jim. Just hand him over. A mercenary's reputation is all that she has, darling. I will not relinquish my prisoner to anyone but the client. Not even to someone with your devilish good looks and brooding intensity. Sorry. We could destroy her operations in this asteroid field. That will get her attention. We'll have to cripple her prime space station. She won't make it easy for us. We need to set up our own base. And one of Mira's fleet stations is nearby. We can take them out and set up our own station. You never see these models used in anything else. And it's kind of sad. Coordinates locked. Keep like, just, just imagine a space flight sim in StarCraft. Using... You'd have, like, Banshees, you could have Wraith, Scout, Protoss Scouts, Vikings. Like, fuck, it'd be fucking cool. Imagine being a fucking Interceptor on a carrier. I don't remember. Interceptor's AI piloted... It would be, right? An Interceptor is an AI-run drone. But you could still be an AI-run drone Interceptor on a carrier. I mean, that'd still be fucking cool. That would be fucking cool, in my opinion. Oh, I gotta remember, I'm playing on hard, aren't I? So I gotta be a little more careful than I would probably normally be. Those ordnance towers have long-range attacks that deal a lot of damage. Fortunately, our long-range Yamato cannon deals even more. Give her a spin on that tower. Well, at least I don't have to worry about energy. God, you can have so many games and game variants come out of StarCraft, and it's just not done. When it really could be cool. If we grab it, I can instantly repair the Hyperion. It'd be fucking cool. But we don't get that shit, and it's sad. I just imagine all the cool games and variety of games you can have. I, fucking awesome, but we don't get that. And it, it's so easy it could be. Nice work. Like, you've got the universe Salvage established. Have it start manufacturing automated fighters for us. Every time it puts a fleet together, it'll send them against Mira's guys. Can we just discuss this with her? It doesn't work that way out here, Valerian. Yeah, look at the wraiths going out now. Hey, magmines. Those babies pack a punch. They come at you in a straight line, so you can dodge them, or even use jump to get out of their way. I think there's an achievement that I have that is to dodge, uh, never get hit by a magmine. Mineral fields. We can harvest these for more resources. Yep. Get those minerals and I can upgrade the Hyperion. Make her even tougher. Yeah, it did, like you could have multiple types of fighters with like, like I said, Vikings, Wraiths, and then you could also fight against Protoss ships and shit like that. It'd be fucking awesome. Bring her around. But we just don't get that. It'd be so cool. So fucking cool it could be. Boy, I, I want that game. Sensors indicate we gathered all the minerals in this area. That's a game I'd love to have. Confirmed. Fucking easy first-person shooter or space flight sims in the StarCraft universe. Get more minerals and I'll do it again. Sensors are picking up Kelmorian operations nearby. They've got some tough defenses, and they've got a capital-class ship. We could always bypass them. They might have some valuable oh, that was close. or equipment. Make 
Okay, I gotta wait for the fighters to recharge. Should just shoot the damn thing. Oh yeah, it's auto building, that's cool. Alright, I don't need that quite yet. Uh oh. And your motto. Uh, it's turned invisible for some bullshit. We're about to be vaporized. I know, I'm going for the drone. Make it so. Bring I need my fighters to regenerate. Easy thrusters. Coordinates locked. Course laid in. There we go. Confirmed. Oh, I see you, you invisible prick. Oh, did he heal? What an asshole! Again, damn it. Laid in. At least I got all my fighters this time. Confirmed. Gotta try and keep my fighters alive. Oh, you prick. No shit. That's so rude. Gotta go in to support fighters. Oh god, you fucker! And there we go. Get that repair. They had an electric field generator. This baby overloads enemy craft, disabling them for a little while. Let's get it installed, Chief Engineer. It's already online, Scooter. I Scooter. Good work. Scooter. Yeah. <laughs> Away, Iberia, I, I just keep thinking of games that we could have just as part of the StarCraft universe and we just don't get them. And it makes me sad because they'd be so fucking cool. So fucking cool. Yeah. Need those reinforcements. Oh, this looks like we do regenerate, so that's nice. That starport is building more ships to send at us. We're going to have to take it out fast. Well. Make it so. Oh, that was close. Uh oh. Shit. Oh. Like, crazy just how much harder this is. Between, like, compared to normal and hard. Oh, at least that's saved. They had an electric field generator. Like, holy shit, the difference. Overloads enemy craft, disabling them for a right, so, they got no upgrades, Let's but I bet they have more engineer. numbers than they normally it's would. Online, Scooter. I do good work. Scooter? Alright, we need to focus that. Bring her around. Force laid in. Keep your eyes open. Multiple hot. Coordinates locked. Oh Matthew, I hate it when we fight. I'm gonna wait till my Matthew shit regens. Kind of strange history. Don't encourage her. Ordnance tower with three kills, they do a ton of damage. Tax squads away. I don't have all of them, but I won't have to do. Ooh, you shot the wrong target. Slam him down with that energy pulse. Confirmed. Major damage. All frames report breaches. 
forces are under attack. Come on, just give me that kill. Starport is building more ships to Does it have an attack? No, it doesn't. We're going to have to take it out fast. Force laid in. Easy thrusters. Let them do the fighting. I'm just going to take it. Target acquired. Come on, almost. There we go. Make it so. Nice work. Let's keep pushing forward. As moves in for a better position. Fully automated bases are quite expensive. Coordinates uh Oh. Laid in. Oh, well. Let's just jump past them. No, 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 no. Oh, that was close. Man, that's got such a big AoE. Oh, did we get hit by one that was still flying? So rude. Alright, well, let's go back. Uh, of course, our ship got hit probably by a mine. Oh, yeah, they even got space stations that you can run missions from and shit. Man, I'm just thinking of games that we could have and I so very badly want. Come on, out of the way. Yes, they came from behind. So close. I must feel like there's one hidden back there for some bizarre reason. Nope. Alright, moving on. Ooh, there's some down here. How nice. Almost missed those. There we go. Hey, the Hyperion's even stronger now. Yeah, you can thank me later. All right, what do we got? Oh, looks like they're sending battle cruisers against us. Okay, let's go deal with that. Are we faster? No, it just must, must be my imagination. Off the fighters go. Oh well, we actually do have more fighters, which is cool. Mm, don't need that, but I'll leave it nearby. Oh dear. Let's pull out of there. Immediately get our fighters back. Ha ha. Uh oh. Right, let's just get rid of this. Get rid of that, it does tons of damage. Let's get rid of this. I like how it's just basically a starport with a few extra bits attached, which is pretty cool on its own. I mean, the Hyperion's clearly a bigger class of ship compared to these battle cruisers. It's really, it's more of a battleship, and that's a battle cruiser, really, is how it seems. Alright, we got one more upgrade for our ship. Easy thrusters. Keep your eyes open. Start collecting. Your forces are under attack. Well. Bring her around. No, you don't, you pricks. You almost got me, but you failed. Alright, well it's not enough for a level, but I guess it's close. I don't think there's anything down there for us to do. You stole all my minerals. Well, technically they were just laying around, so were they really yours? Course laid in. Uh oh. Easy thrusters. Make it so. Bring her around. Alright. Yeah, I don't see any minerals nearby. Nice and engaged target. Confirm visual on target. Keep your eyes open. 
Uh, excuse me. At least I got my own firing now. Matthew, don't think I will make this easy on you. When have you ever made anything easy on me? I always thought you like it, Roth. Alright, let's get rid of this. There we go. Pull back a bit. Nice. Should be able to finish it off nice and easily. Alright, this should give us... Yeah, there we go. Oh, nice level up. I wonder, does the Yamato increase in damage as we upgrade it? That would be cool. Because we're getting extra fighters. But I don't know if we're getting anything else. No, I'd have to shoot a fresh one to find out. Yes, I think it does do more damage. That's pretty cool. All right, we should have yeah, new, nice two battle cruisers here. All right, that pretty much kills her fighter capacities. Just surrender, Matthew. I'll be nice to you, I promise. That's what I'm afraid of. Or imagine if those could hit our own space station. That would be cool. You brought this on yourself, Mira. I wanted to play nice. Nice and easy. All squads away, I bear cage target. Make it so. You fail! I've already moved on. Oh, this ought to do some finishing damage. There we go. Send you back to Mirahan. And tell me what you need. Ha, <laughs> poor bastard. Marauder, thanks to you, Matthew. But I will see you again. Not too soon, I hope. And I thought Dominion politics were vicious. Mercenaries and pirates, man. Oh, yeah, don't let a magmine hit. Does it tell me? Your mother kills. Magmine damage taken. I got a hit. Uh, I don't know if that means I got a hit. I don't know. I also don't know if we go, if there's a, I don't know if there's three or two. I think there's two. Brood mother Noctul has contacted us. She speaks for the remaining brood mothers, not under your control. Well, that's they nice. Feel your power and they wish to return to the swarm. Brood mothers, hear me. I am sending you the location of our enemies across the sector. Destroy them. Burn their strongholds in my name. Then, you shall be one with the swarm. We shall do this, my queen. With their return, the swarm will be whole. You are very near to your victory. <laughs> oh, Hyperion's here. The brood mothers dislike working with Terrans. They were necessary to my plans. They are asking if we may destroy the Terrans, now that they are no longer useful. Tell them the Terrans are not to be harmed. It is my will. I will tell them, my queen. I like Keisha. He's nice. Have you found anything? Colonel Orlin is hacking into the Dominion net right now. Tell him he's got one hour. I won't do that, Kerrigan. You're already in over your head. Don't make it worse. If the Dominion sense our intrusion, they'll move Jim or kill him. I'm not going to risk failure because you are impatient. So save your threats. You've done some growing up since your mojo. 
Zerg are not the only ones who adapt. Very well. I will wait for your expert to do his work. There will be no essence here. I cannot collect if there is none. We are here because our queen orders it. Do not dare question. I follow for essence. You must learn obedience, Primal. Yes, come to me. I will collect your essence now. Enough. Zagara, do not speak for me. Tahaka, do not collect from my swarm. Let's see if Abath has got anything. Ooh, he does. Is it possible for the swarm to hack into the Dominion's network? Terran systems inelegant. Problem with interchange. Many factors obstruct request. Biology. Language. So our thoughts are too different for anything beyond simple transmissions. Accurate. Zerg processes complex. Incompatible with Terran machinery. Then it's up to Valerian now. Too bad. Imagine Zerg hacking mass planetary networks and manufacturing hubs. That'd be crazy. I'm fairly certain Protoss could probably do that, though. Alright, I hope people enjoyed. I think there's one more mission in space where we break Jim out, but I could be wrong. It's been a while since I played Heart of the Swarm. Alright, later.